Detroit Autorama 2013, and uh, I never thought I'd get a chance to shoot a video on Saturday, but uh, no music, the crowd's kind of heavy, so I'm going to try to get this done, but there's probably going to be people cutting in front of me. Um, and I wanted to shoot it the other day, but they didn't, they wouldn't open the hood, or they couldn't get the hood open, I didn't have the keys or whatever, but it's a V10 charger. I don't know what year, the new body, obviously the new body style one, but anyways, it's over at the Mopar Performance uh, booth, and uh, it's probably not going to be a long video, but I'm going to see if I can get something for you. And like I said, the sandwich board doesn't even say what year it is, but you can see, and there was really no sense in shooting this car unless I could get the hood on it. can say that uh, this thing's got a viper motor in it but you want to see it I'm trying to get back so you can see let me get over here let me get out of the crowd now this dude follows me over here I'm gonna beat him with my stick he's not a, he's not a fan he's an idiot <laughs> I don't know what else to say but it's a cool car cool looking car and then of course it's got that v10 in it the Viper motor. You can never go wrong with that. It must be a it must be a 13. Because that looks like a new taillight package in there. I don't know. Somebody will know though. Somebody will correct me. It's got this uh well it's got the stripe across the back, but it's got this satin finish in the middle too. This is a very cool car. Like I said, if I can get up here, maybe I can get a shot. A little clearing here. Get these two pot belly boys out of my way. Clear the shot, fellas. There you go. There you go. too cool to walk by. So I thought. That is just uh, that's the way they should have built them. That's the way they should have built them. So anyways, there you go. Hey, uh, I'm going to say it's a 2013 Charger V10 Mopar Performance Detroit Autorama 2013. Hope you enjoyed it. See you.